Yeah, I saw. <laughs> I'm actually pretty jealous right now. What's up everyone, Mark and Nicholas back again with a new unboxing. Today we'll be doing a new Retro Game Treasure unboxing. And for those who don't know what Retro Game Treasure is, it's a monthly subscription service that you get video games, video games you get to keep. And there's a whole bunch of games that you could choose, well, consoles you could choose from. Nintendo, Super Nintendo, Genesis, uh, Dreamcast, PlayStation. 64. 64. All the kinds of the Game Boys, like all the... Uh, all the portable units, even portable some of the units. newer ones now. They have Nintendo DS, the original DS. Oh. Which is, it's really cool. And yeah, they... It you, stops at PlayStation 1 or PlayStation 2? Xbox as well. Xbox as well. 360? Anyways, 360. No, 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 no 360. No 360. So, no that's 360. The that's, that's as not retro as possible. So, you have a list that you can fill out. All the games that you already own. That way you don't get any doubles. Mm -hmm. There's also a list of, uh, a wish list where you can put games that you actually want. Though you can't expect anything super expensive. But no, Exactly. And another one is the type of games that you're into. Because sometimes you don't know what what games are out there. And you can just... I hate racing games. I hate NASCAR, but I found out that I checked it off a while back. Anyways, they compile you a box of games that you keep. Now, nobody's box is exactly the same. So if you watch anybody else's video, they're going to get different games because it's based on their stuff. <laughs> it's kind of guaranteed that it will be something <laughs> different. You usually get between three to five games depending yep. on the value of each game. Exactly. So while I'm opening this up... On my side, I will do a, some sort of research uh, on each game he will be revealing and like that will be knowing at the end what is the final total to see if the whole thing is worth it. Alright, so I'm gonna open this guy up. I got my knife here and where is it? Okay. Now, first things first, the box this month is like totally, utterly trashed. <laughs> it was like a little bit later than usual, like a few days uh, late. So I'm assuming it's because, I mean, it's kind of related. Yeah, uh, I before they used to ship out Canada stuff very early. Now I find if they do ship it out early, we still get it at the same time as yeah. everybody else. Anyways, but that's not because of them. That probably no, because it's of... not their fault. At least we don't think so. Yeah. All right, first reveal. Open it up and da -da 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 -da. plastic right. protector. So I put this off to the side. Plastic protector, but it changes every month. <laughs> okay. All right, first game. N64. N64. Oh! <laughs> Ooh, nice! <laughs> Pokemon Snap for N64. Looks uh, sunburned. Though. Oh, it looks totally sunburned. Now, you know, I've never played this game in a house. I've always played it played it at Blockbuster. There was um, a kiosk set up uh -huh. in Blockbuster. You don't need any peripherals to play this, right? I think there is one if you want, which is some sort of a microphone. Okay, thing. that's what I thought. It's, it's for Pokemon Snap? I, I I think so. Okay. All right. So that's that one. There All right. There. Next. All right. Next. Super Nintendo. There's only two other games in here. Well, there's three left in here. So okay. So four. four this month. Okay. <gasps> yeah, I saw. <laughs> I'm, I'm actually pretty jealous right now. <laughs> Super Star Wars for SNES. That is awesome. There's a whole bunch of, I think, Super um, Star Wars games. I think there's like an Empire Strike Back and all that. But that's really cool to get a Star Wars game. Yeah, plus it looks It's in pretty, pretty good shape. shape. I mean, maybe not like... Now, uh, I see a label curve. on it saying Player's Choice, blah, blah, blah. Is that because it's like a reissue? Like a greatest hits kind of deal? Like we get nowadays? I honestly, I don't think so. Because they didn't do that back no, then. I don't think they used to do that back then. Because that would like, kind of suck. <laughs> not, not forgetting this game that it's a, a greatest hits, but like if they actually did that. Thanks. Okay, well, Genesis. Genesis. Tasmania! <laughs> it's actually a game I, I wanted. I don't know I'm why. sorry, but he's my favorite of all the Looney Tunes. Really? Yeah. <laughs> well, him and uh, Wiley uh, Coyote. So yeah, there's Tasmania. That's cool. And last, but not least. Wait a second. Tasmania is with a Z, right? 
Uh, T A Z hyphen mania. Yeah, okay, all right, yeah, yeah, go on, yeah. Okay, last game. Y Yoshi? Oh! Oh! But what's that? Is that like Yoshi's cookies or something? Are you serious? I don't. What's Yoshi? <laughs> I mean, what is the game? Or what is like, the game? Like, cause, cause that's. I know, I know Yoshi. what Yoshi is, but what? It's, 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 it's the first Yoshi game they released for uh, NES. Really? It's, it's like a uh, Yoshi, um, Yoshi Island. Really? There was a game like that? I mean, I almost feel like I have. It's this been game a while, already. so I don't remember <laughs> correctly myself. But. Like I, I have Yoshi's cookies, and I think that's what it looks like to me. We'll see the gameplay after. All right. So that is that, and that is it for the box. Whoa. Okay. The little bit of damage that the box received on the outside kind of went onto the inside, but thankfully it didn't damage the okay. games. Like you could see oh, yeah. that oh, it's. Oh yeah. That it really. What happened there? I, I, it's like it was soaked in water or something. The perks of it, f like, pouring these past couple of weeks. Uh, so that's it. You have your little explanation here for the boss crate that you share a picture of your stuff and you enter more chances to win this boss crate that uh, you'd like to get one of these days. But, yeah. who knows? So that is it. So you got all the prices? Yes. All right. Pretty good month. <laughs> Pretty good month? Okay, that's good. Pretty good okay. month. Okay, because you were, like, dead quiet. So I'm like, Ugh. I'm not good in that. <laughs> You're not good All at right. math. Okay. We'll start for Nintendo 64 Pokemon Snap. Twenty dollars. Twenty dollars. There's more. There's less. Uh, it all depends on the quality. Uh, yeah, that one is uh, yellow. Yeah. And uh, once again. All the prices I, I will say will be in Canadian. Uh, if you're from the States, you should maybe round it up a little bit lower. Or well, round it down a little bit lower. You don't round it up a little bit lower. It's like a double negative. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Next. Yeah. Super Nintendo Star Wars. $15. Cool. I don't know if I ever played this one. There's a lot of listings with uh, boxes. Really? Yeah, with boxes. And so, they are like more and more expensive, obviously. So uh, it's like to own it, you have to own it with a box to sell it. <laughs> I have a feeling, yeah. <laughs> uh, Tasmania, Sega so Genesis. Yeah. Another fifteen dollars. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah. I think this is a side-scrolling game. I, I, I have no idea. I never played that. I it's, want to play it. It's amazing though that the label. There's literally like no title on it. The title is only up here. Like. Is that the same thing for all Genesis? I don't think so. I think they have a, a title there as well. Which is funny. Super Nintendo Yoshi. No, Nintendo, <laughs> not Super Nintendo. NES. NES. NES Yoshi. $15. Cool. For a total of $65. There we go. Now, I pay for my stuff every three months, and it averages out to around $55 a month Canadian. So, $65. That's great. That's not with shipping or anything like that. Exactly. And what I pay the fifty-five dollars is with the included shipping fee. So that's that's damn so good. So in the end, you're saving a lot of money. Yeah. Now for a bunch of games that I wouldn't maybe necessarily go to the store or whatnot. I'm sorry, but them. personally, I love those. I love Yoshi, I love Star Wars, I love Pokemon. I want to play this one again. I'm really, I'm really curious. Too about bad. It's like highly sunburned. Yeah. Um, I mean. Who cares in the end? But you know. that's what I like about this service. I didn't have like any super uh, any N sixty four games when I first started out. Now I have like a huge library, and you know what? If you guys want to try it out for a month, two months, whatever, you can get two dollars off your first box by typing in all the nerds, all capitals, when you first sign up, and you get two dollars off. Two dollars off US, which is great. A great little start. If you want to try it out, at least for a month, if you don't want to continue it, don't continue it. There's no obligation or anything like that. And uh, if you like to collect, you will like it. That's basically it. <laughs> well, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. See ya.